me, uh, when I came in, I, I wanted to give you a medal for endurance. Uh, I've been at a number of other meetings while you were holding forth here with some 65 witnesses. The number of witnesses indicate the severity of the problem. If we weren't severe, we would have maybe five or ten people up here. I want to welcome you, uh, Mr. Burns. This is your first appearance for this council. I want to thank you for agreeing to come to one of the most complex, difficult jobs, I think, in America. And I thank you for that. I know a number of questions that Mr. Graham has asked were decisions made before you got here. We recognize that. But I joined Mr. Graham in these most likely things. And, and I start, well, I start where Mr. Graham left off about these housing, these federal vouchers. What vouchers are we talking about? I know some of them are veterans, about, I think about 75 of those. I mean, what vouchers are we talking about? Housing choice? You're referring to the vouchers that we spoke of we'd be receiving? No, that you would uh, be giving people. There was somewhere in your statement about, Mr. Burns' statement about vouchers, mm -hmm. housing choice vouchers. I want to know. I know the housing voucher program very well. Well, I just talk about the general subject. In terms of the housing choice vouchers, there are 26,000 people on the waiting list. We have about 10,000 vouchers. Turnover is about 400. My question is, how do you intend to get any people on the housing choice voucher program? With that long waiting list and with uh, a turnover of about 400. Yeah, and just referring back to your question about the vouchers, what was alluded to was the the four million sh the four million shifts or loss in our budget. We were able to receive vouchers that covered those those costs, so that we wouldn't have to take anybody out of housing. Where did those vouchers come from? From the housing authority. We haven't actually yet received them, but that's part of the plan. Well, I don't think you're going to receive them because I said, and I used to chair the committee on housing and development. I know all about that. There's some federal rules about that. You have to be on a waiting list. And that waiting list is so tight and secret that you got to go in order for it. You can't take X number of people. And well, Mr. Graham, I just think we ought to just check that out because that is—I I don't believe it at all. 